I guess some things from America have already translated around the world. And I guess that would be laughing in the face of tragedy. <laughs> it's, that's a part of America, folks, that you don't want. You do not want. I've been told not to use contractions in front of French people, so... <laughs> has nothing to do with you. Hasn't anything to do with you, okay? <laughs> But folks, this much is true. You can't be uncompromising and without compassion in this world. Yeah. And I'll tell you why exactly. Because while you were doing this punk rock retro thing, <laughs> Looks like your neck's been broken. Seems to happen somewhere every year. There's none of them that they clutch themselves and they cry. Their favorite son will never walk again. Coach says that boy. Gave 100% What spirit What a States of America, I had to take a second job. Believe it or not, because the economy, you may have noticed the economy everywhere, it's just miserable. And I wish less people in this room knew English than what I'm going to say right now, because unfortunately that job that I had to take was with the press department at the United States White House. it's not all bad. After all, all those leaks that you've heard in newspapers have probably all come from me. <laughs> and look, I've got an exclusive. Do you know what an exclusive is without it just being an adjective? Folks, I have an exclusive for all of you here about the next plan that America has in the long run, it is. <laughs> Folks, I'm going to tell you about this new leak in musical form. I love 
I love you, man. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 
especially bad for me. But I told my doctor that what is more important than my life is my fans. However, after, after that last song, look, yeah, the case sera sera, right? Folks, after that last song, I have to be honest, I don't think I can do any more of the show. I, I, all of us have been having the runs, which tells you what Parisian food is like. And, but the more, the more important fact, folks, is that I came under the existential realization when I was outside Jim Morrison's grave. That I have actually become too old for punk rock. Now, folks, here's something more important. Listen to this. You listen to this. Not only am I too old for punk rock, you are all too old for punk rock. Fucking. You know, it's 2020, or in Parisian years, 25-25, I don't know. But folks, get out of, look, this should make sense to all of you being French. Punk rock? <laughs> Daft punk? Yeah. Because I know I'm in a room full of Daft Punk fans, I figure we could probably get away with some new wave music. Music on new wave! How do y'all feel about that? You really have no choice.
Whoa. Funny but absolutely true story. I like to, before every show, go incognito. That's a not American word for like being sneaky in the crowd. Uh, seeing that nobody can see me. So I can like overhear people, you know, kind of get a vibe for how the room is doing. And <laughs> that already happened. Folks, but here's the interesting thing that happened for me. There were these two 15-year-old skateboarder kids that were out there. Evidently, evidently they had tricked their parents into seeing, thinking they were seeing that Blade Runner movie. You know, but instead they came to the show. And I could tell that much because they were all like, uh, I don't mean to insult anybody, but it was all like, zhu 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 zhu, Blade Runner, zhu 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 zhu. Uh, you know, punk rock, zhu zhu zhu. But the one thing that I did notice, because this happens a lot, that I used Google Translator, put it up to what they were saying, and these kids, they were so proud of themselves, and I quote, because they were doing their parents one better by being able to go see the dead milkmen. <laughs> hey, in the rest of Europe, that joke kills. Okay, so think about that, Parisians. But think about this, too. Who exactly is on this stage? Oh. That's what you do want to know. So, let's... <laughs> ah, ah, it is. Friends, if you want to get with me, there's some things you got to know. I like my beats fast. And my bass down low. You people really are Philistines, but you were smart enough to show up here. So please, Give it up to my friend, cohort, and bass player, Mr. Klaus Lorai. Now, folks, I'm a little worried about this one. If you're walking down the street and you're beginning to feel the heat, of that rock steady beat? Well, Mister, you better start to move your feet because you're probably being chased by this man behind me. Please give it up for drummer, poet, and action star, D.H. Kaleko. a shorter version, so we're just going to move on. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Folks, we are going to give the four short version of this, though. You are going to help me out here for what little English you know. Folks, the man from Mars no longer eats cars. Now he only eats... on Google lyrics before me. Folks, I'm gonna cut to the short cheese. Now he only eats guitars. And friends, nobody eats how about that? And folks, nobody eats a guitar. I didn't have any internet connection. I wasn't able to do the research. I had I had to go to McDonald's for internet. Folks Nobody eats a guitar better than this motherfucker to my left who has now got the longest introduction. That was very clever. Folks, folks, please give it up for Mr. E. Please give it up for Mr. East Bay Ray. Shows, but we haven't played with Jennifer Lopez in years, so please let me know if I um, By the way, some people have to shout. Some people can just whisper. 
Some people just whisper. He's not so bad. This is our singer, no. Skip McSkipster. for the kind, smart words of Mr. D.H. Pellegro. All right, Paris France. You guys still awake out there? Yeah! yeah. Okay, so check it out. I'm walking around. Okay, Patty, today. And I'm checking out the people and feeling what they're feeling. Race relations look pretty good on the outside. Pretty good on the outside. But there's always something lurking in the shadows. When I was at the cemetery today, I saw all kinds of fucking haunting thoughts of what this town used to be, and what people used to be, and how people wanted to take this fucking place over. And I don't know about you, but I think music, in general, punk rock brings us together, and racism tears us apart. As much as I am not a fan of Adolf Hitler or Marine Le Pen, I think they should all go to hell and all the alt-right fuckers should go to hell in one fiery boat. And all those Nazi punks can fuck them Nazi punks!
is gonna play, 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 play. And the head is gonna hit, 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 hit. I'm just gonna shake, 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 shake it off, shake it off, shake it off, shake it off, shake off all the scum, shake off all the villainy, shake off all the Maz Eisley, and just let it hang loose, man. Because you walk without the rhythm. Won't attract the worm. Walk without the rhythm, and you won't attract the worm. Through the name of world peace, through the name of world prophets.
didn't notice. That doesn't, folks, that's no moon. That's a space station. And beyond that, yellow air, yellow clouds. Thank you for coming out. Put the lights on this.